Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Princeton and Notre Dame is brought to you by Princeton Orthopedic Associates. We're at Mercer County Park for one of the most anticipated hockey games of the week, Princeton versus Notre Dame. Princeton with that number one spot in the Colonial Valley Conference. Fighting Irish looking to make a statement tonight with a win. This one had all the makings of an instant classic. Both teams making it difficult for one another as we sit scoreless for most of the first. With eight seconds to go before the break, it looks like it'll remain that way until Keith Goldberg gets the party jumping with the first goal of the game to help Princeton take a 1-0 lead going into the second. Irish head coach Andrew Ducko told his team to just relax and play the next 15 minutes, but Ryan Nemec only needs a couple seconds to answer back with this shot. Nemec tying the game at once for the Irish, just 10 ticks into the second. This is a conference game and these teams making it very clear in the period, they're not here to make friends. Especially Ben Killian who just rockets in this one for another Notre Dame score. Killian helps the Irish take a 2-1 lead to close out the second. Princeton opened up the third with a score from Steven Avis, so we're all tied up at 2-2 to begin the final period. And Avis still feeling the hype juice, says I'll raise you one. Gets the pass from Ryan McCormick, and he's gonna need a bigger cup. Steven Avis gives the Little Tigers a 3-2 lead with 5.43 to go in the game. It's getting late, and these teams getting even more chippier as we near the two minute mark. Irish desperate for a score. Good thing they have Vinny Gian Grasso, who slips this one past the keeper to tie the game up at 3-3 with 2.05 remaining. With just seconds to go in an incredible game, it is a shame we might see a tie, but let's not get ahead of ourselves. Ben Killian for Notre Dame says ties are for meeting parents. Killian gets the go-ahead goal for ND with 42 seconds left, and they are losing their minds in Mercer County Park. What a big time moment to put a stamp on this classic. There would be no answer from the conference leaders, and Notre Dame can sleep good tonight knowing what they just did. 4-3 is your final from West Windsor. The Notre Dame Fighting Irish with two big goals in the third to help them take down top-ranked Princeton. Ben Killian giving you one of the best finishes you'll see all year, and it's only January. Irish improved to 8-3. They'll take on Robbinsville next. Princeton showing us why they are running the show in Mercer County. An incredible job by the Little Tigers to fight for three halves. They dropped a 7-3-2 and, and will try to bounce back against South Brunswick. Afterwards, we caught up with our hero of the game to see how he got it done. Uh, well, my line mates, Ryan Nemec and um, Nate Goldberg, they've been feeding me the puck and we all been moving the puck really well and Nate got the puck on the wing and just Made a nice pass in the middle of the ice, moved the goalie, and just saw a shot, and I took it. I'm Nery Rodriguez, and you already know, it's Jersey Sports Zone. Want to see highlights and features from your favorite school? Jersey Sports Zone is entirely supported by our great sponsors. Email marketing at jerseysportszone.com to get your business in front of our loyal audience and highlights from your hometown.